What about you, Sarah? Why should they help you? Really? Well, children belong in families. We can have many orphanages, we have, can have many children's homes, but if this child grows up in an orphanage or child, children's home, there is something they are missing. I really would feel that if we can help place back these children in families, there are many other police stations in Kampala, in Jinja, in Mokono, wherever, in every place of Uganda, children are hanging on the streets. Let's come and work together. Here as Heart to Heart Initiative, we are very willing to do the work. Support us. We will go to the slums, we will go to the streets, we will go to the communities, We'll educate the people, we'll let them know. And we have done it without money, we have done it without funds. What, what about the government, for example? It has certain departments, frankly, that uh, uh, are supposed to be providing, you know, uh, adding value. What about social welfare departments and what have you? Yes, um, number one, I would like to speak about these departments. I work closely with the police and the probation office. You have a minute. The probation is the, probation, the welfare office. But the government allocates very little resources to that office. If they could increase those resources, probably the welfare office would be of help to us. Very but good. they don't have. You have the last word? <laughs> Once again, thank seconds. you for having me on the show. One of my favorite quotes is by Magic Johnson in which he said, every child needs a little bit of hope, a little bit of help, and someone to believe in them. And that's why we are here. We believe in these children. These are our future leaders. And it's up to each and every one of us. So I challenge you, you watching the show today, to take action. Visit the website, empowerthechildren.org. Many ways to support. Um, connect with us, send us an email, and we'll definitely get back to you. So thank you, and share this uh, broadcast on Facebook as well. Thank you. On that note, Thanks to our three distinguished guests, Emilia Ajay, Ruth Kendeje Diabahika, and Sarah Kwagara Kasozi.